Hey guys, we are in Pakatans. We're in a different Pakatans. Um, as most of you crafters may know, Pakatans is closing. And here in my area, the Pakatans will be open for three more weeks. So I happen to be in this area. So I said, let me just come and see what they have. So I think I am going to grab these smiley faces. Yep. So we'll be back. All right, bye. I'm going to have to get used to going to uh, Michael's. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to show you what I have so far. So right now, I have 30 of these because you could get 30 of these little wooden word tiles, not tiles, but um, this word, wooden word. I don't know what this is called exactly, but uh, you can get 30 of these for a dollar. And then these were 70% off. And I got the ones for like $3.98. So it's like a $1.19. And then I got a couple of these small ones, which would be 75 cents, because it's 70% off. And then I have 15 of these type of unfinished wood. This is Chevron. And then I have Triangle. And you could get 15 of these for a dollar. Now, what I just came across are these wooden shelves these unwooden shelves pegboard shelves and i really like these and i'm gonna grab all four of them i don't know the exact price but um they're 70 percent off so we'll see what it rings up to be so i'm gonna go see what it rings up to be and i'll be back I'm thinking about getting one of these. I just don't know what shape I want. I don't know if I want to go with this diamond shape or this um, pentagon shape. I mean hexagon shape, sorry. Because it got six sides. Let me check. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six hexagon. Um, I want to make a trivet so that it can sit on my stove. So, yeah, I don't know between this one or this one here's their farmhouse decor now this is this is cute so and that's $12.99 so I'm trying to see the price on here So, I don't know if this is, oops, I don't know if this is chalkboard, chalkboard, it might, it might be, 
but it was $12.99, so basically $13. So you could get it for $5.20. So I might look over here to see if I see a, um, something that I might like. We'll see. And when I get in the car, I'll show you what I actually got. I had to um, change some things around because they're going to be open until the 29th. So, I don't want to, some stuff that I know is going to be here, I want to come back and get it and the things that I know I need right now, I want to get that now. So, alright guys, next time I see you, I'll be doing a little haul. Alright, bye. and I'm about to do a little haul of the things that I got from Packetans and I'm sorry you can't really see my face because of how I got the phone up on the dashboard and I can't move I was trying to move the uh, steering wheel but I can't get it down so I'm gonna have to just lean but I showed you guys some of the sales that they had and I'm going to show you guys what I got. But before I do that, in one of my clips, you're going to see that I had a whole bunch of wooden stuff in my cart because I got eye happy. I saw these things and I was like, oh, I want that. I want that. And then when I walked around with the stuff, like I normally do, I maul things over and I realized I don't need that right now. And if I want it, they had so many of those things left that... I can come back and if they're still here and for that price I can get it but I had a budget and I wanted to stay within my budget and I only went over my budget for like I only went over my budget um, two dollars two dollars over my budget two dollars and some change over my budget so that's not bad but anyway I'm going to show you what I got what I got and kind of give you guys an idea of what I'm thinking about doing with these things so I hope you guys can see see the stuff I got. I'm gonna probably put it close to the camera. Oh, really quick. In another clip I mentioned I had picked up some ceramic pieces. Um, one was a diamond shape and the other one was a hexagon. And I wanted <laughs> I was going to get one and then I totally forgot because something else caught my eye. But hopefully when I come back they'll have it because I wanted to turn it into a trivet. But I totally forgot. So anyway, all right, the first thing I'm going to show you is this. This is a CMYK stamps, bright and happy st stamp from We Are Memory Keepers. Okay. And this is what the back looks like. Now, I do have a question, crafty friends, please comment down below. Do I have to have 
this thing right here to use this so please let me know down below um, this was two dollars so not a bad deal okay. the next thing I got were these little banners and I had more of these but again was mulling it over and I said I don't need all of these banners um, and I really like these more than the triangles and they had a whole bunch of these left too these were 75 cents so really like these these are really cute then the next thing I got these were 33 cents they were 18 18 for I can't remember if you got 18 you got it for like less than a dollar I think but the variety they had were was not um, very wide a lot of them was a lot of duplicates and I didn't want a whole bunch of flowers and um, this tree background I didn't want to get like 18 of those so I just chose to go with these two and they are they were 33 cents this one I'm thinking about doing a fall theme card with this um, I really want to do some fall themed projects this year then this thing I got this is so cute it was in their garden it was in the garden section but this specific one was like random it was someplace else but uh, it was 70 I believe it was 77 cents so, and what I'm thinking about doing is I might stain it or I might paint it. I'm not for sure. And then put a uh, little clip here. And then I'm going to put something that goes with each season. And I'm going to put it on my kitchen table. So, yay. I like that. Then these, this was what I was really excited for. When I stumbled across these, it changed everything. This is what changed my cart. When I saw these um, shelves right here. These were a dollar, I'm trying to, what were they? They were a dollar 49 a piece, so basically a dollar 50 a piece. And these are unfinished pegboard, an uh, unfinished pegboard shelf. And I got five of these. So three of them, three of them are small like this. So it's a five inch by nine inch or 12.7 centimeters by 22.8 centimeters so I got three that are this size and then I got two that are this size and the size for this is 5 inch by 12 inch or one or I'm sorry or 12.7 centimeters by 30.4 centimeters I am so happy that I came across these shelves because I want to do something in my kitchen we recently acquired a smaller uh, kitchen table and so it opens up a lot of space um, on that back wall and I was on Pinterest and I saw shelves and I saw some that were reasonable but anyway so I want to do a shelving unit in my um, a little decorative shelving in my kitchen and I might use this option back here getting a pegboard because it seems like pegboard is really inexpensive so I might do something like this and that way you can move the shelf around and I like that and also it's not going to be too many holes in the wall because I probably would just have to put the pegboard on and then get some pegs for this and then I can move it however I want but these are the items I got and I'm so happy with what I got I think that's everything let me just double check yep because everything else in there are uh, our boards are the other boards so like I said I'm really happy with what I got and if you guys have any questions any comments comment down below and I'll see you all in my next video bye